Spurgeon here with RevZilla to talk to you about the next XG10 Bad Loser graphic available at RevZilla.com. So the next XG10 is going to be the three-quarter helmet from Nex. Really retro-inspired feel with this, and the Bad Loser graphic is going to be available in one color. You're going to have the gloss black for the real base with this, and then you're going to see the motorcycle or the Maria Motorcycle Company logos all over it to really give it that retro race-inspired feel. Now, if you're not familiar with the XG10, what you're getting is an X Matrix composite shell. Three different shell sizes available, and what we get when we put this on the scale is in a medium, it comes in at two pounds two ounces to give this helmet a very nice lightweight feel. It's going to be ECE, it's going to be DOT, and when we're talking about fitment for this, it's going to be a neutral oval. That means it's a little bit shorter front to back, a little bit more room in the side of the head. It's really going to work great for you folks out there that are rocking a round noodle on top of your shoulders. Now, as far as all the detailed down and dirty facts in this helmet, like the fact that the entire inside is removable and replaceable, check out our detailed breakdown video on the XG10 where we rip the insides out and we show you everything that's going on with this helmet. Now, quick note when we're talking about the graphics. Like I said earlier, this is the bad loser graphic. And the one thing you're gonna notice is you watch all the videos and take a close look at the helmets, they do change a few things when you're looking at the different graphics packages. And what you're gonna notice is that the binding around the edge of the helmet, on this version, it's not stitched. It's just a nice rubberized binding. Some of them will have a stitching to it. And you're also gonna notice the cheek pads on this are gonna be done in leather. This is going to be one way you'll see them. You'll also see them done with a mesh cloth lining to it. So really just kind of pay attention to those details to make sure you get the right helmet for what you're looking to accomplish. Now, as far as the graphic is concerned, you're gonna notice Maria Motorcycle Company all over this in different logos. And Maria is a motorcycle company based out of Portugal, and they make no qualms about the fact that Deus is their number one inspiration. So these guys do custom motorcycles, they do surfboards, they do skateboards, and they serve you one mean cup of coffee. And the reason Nex is gonna feature them all over their helmet is the fact that they're a Portugal brand, so Nex is showing them a little bit of love. So really what you're getting when you're looking at the Bad Loser is a retro feel to this. It has that nice retro race look to it. And there's a really nice hand touch to this. It feels like the, the graphics were all done in hand, by hand. There's just a really nice overall feel when you're taking a look at the graphics on this helmet. So if you're looking for something that's gonna give your retro-inspired bike a little retro-inspired love, the next XG10 does a really nice job of incorporating more of that retro feel to their three-quarter lids. There's a lot of folks out there rocking Nex helmets, and if you wanna hear more about what they have to say, click the info button on your desktop or mobile device to read other rider reviews from folks that are already out there rocking Nex helmets on their rides. If you have more questions for us, never hesitate to reach out and give us a call, 877-792-9455, or simply type us out an email, cs at revzilla.com. Thank you for joining us for this look at the next XG10 Bad Loser graphic. I'm Spurge. Enjoy the ride.